Hey, hey, Jelly Toast here, back with more Persona 5 Royal. I'm doing an earlier stream today because I have stuff to do at night. And yeah, I look like a mess, but let's do this. I at least want to play a little bit of Royal today before I head out. Uh, and I'm testing to see how good internet connection is during the day to see if I could play Dai Gakuten Zaiban during the daytimes. So anyways, let's go to sleep. No, no. This isn't going to be easy. Let's keep our guard up. Sleep! Would you join the Phantom Thieves? Please, I'm begging you. No normal person could join. We're heading to the palace today, yeah? A good idea, I'd say. Although we mustn't rush, of course. Yeah, honestly, if we want to accomplish anything, we gotta get out there. I agree. Is that all right, leader? Uh, let's go. Hell yeah, let's secure a route to the treasure. In that case, let's meet at the hideout after school. Yes. The hideout after school, then. Should we tell you she's all up? Well, we should probably still leave her alone. I don't think leaving her alone is a good idea, though. We should check in on her, at least. Tell everyone to be at the hideout. We should talk all talk this over before we infiltrate the palace. Can I at least talk to Chihaya first, for the alarm? Hmm. <gasps> Makoto's sitting next to me! <laughs> oh, Akechi, I like that scarf. Oh, oh, Yusuke's beautiful face is covered up by that stupid steel Madoki's heart sign. Seems everyone has arrived. Let us begin. February 3rd is the date we agreed on with Dr. Madoki. We gotta go find that treasure already. Once that date passes, it's over. We all get that, right? Hmm. We'll have to discover a route by February 2nd to be more precise. That's another way to look at it. And nice, you actually remembered. Of course well, I did. Yeah. It wouldn't be a terrible idea to secure our route sooner rather than later. We must deliberate, however. We have no idea what's going to happen. Yeah, Dr. Maruki's pretty much got the power of God. I doubt anything's gonna go smoothly. We better not let our guard down. Oh, of course, I can't go to Chihaya before I talk to... I mean, I go to the palace. Of course. <gasps> Sumida's already here! <gasps> these make these sounds so negative. I want to be like, yes, I'm happy to see you. Right here. Yes, we're gonna fight him. Yes! Yes! Personal awakening? Heck yeah! Yes! So proud of you! <laughs> Time to team up. ありがとうございます。となるとあとは行動ネームだな。行動ネーム。行動ネーム。本名で呼び合ってちゃ。おや、ウィダーバッドサイドオンハーカー。なるほど。ジョーカー、何かいいやんあるか。ビーチハードファ
Now here's the thing, my final party setup. Since it is the first time I'm doing Royal, I do want to have Akechi and uh, Sumire in my party. Because they are the new peoples. And so I should use them. But then that means getting rid of... Uh, do I get rid of my boys? I don't think I could get rid of Makoto. Because she's best girl. Oh my gosh. But, oh man, Yusuke and Judy's power. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Uh, I really don't want to give up Makoto. But... No, you know what? I will have Makoto in there. And if I need to switch them out, I'll just change them out mid-battle. Because I feel like... I feel like Makoto and Sumide's roles overlap a lot. But... Oh, no. But I love Makoto. So I'll do it. Okay. Yeah, I'll do that. And I don't have an alarm, so I can't fuse final weapons and whatnot. I like how everyone has different mask designs. Oh, okay, she moved. Okay, so we are teleporting. We can't teleport? Fine. Hey, Twiffle, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Hope you're having a good day. Hmm. I don't sense any shadows. There are considerably less people in this area. Nope, I lied. There they are. Jeanette! Just got out of school? Nice! Just a little more to go. Violet, are you holding up okay? Hi. Yes! Sorry, it's just... I feel a little off. My outfit! Uh, are you sure you're okay? I let my guard down for a second, but I swear I'm fine. So sorry for making you all worry. That's fine and all, but don't hold us back either. If you push yourself harder than you're capable of handling, you'll endanger everyone on your side too. Enemies approaching! They're fast. I don't know what the heck they are, but we'd better move it. Should we get back to it? If things start looking bad, we'll retreat right away. Until then, we'll back you up with everything we've got. When did school start for you? Did it just start yesterday? The 16th? <gasps> that early? Dude, that sucks. <gasps> Where's her persona? Also, I hope you're still doing school from at home and you're not actually going into the building. Stay safe. You're not- Wait, you're- You're going into the building? Also, Shadow just like, hey, we'll just stand around. <laughs> I am not going into the building. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh, I was freaked out, man. Sister! Why are you playing so damn early? Hey Web! Long time no see! I hope you've been well, friends! I'm playing early today because I have dinner plans tonight. With little toes. So I wanted to get a stream in. Uh, because I really want to continue playing Royal content. And... I wanted to test out how my internet connection is during the daytime. 
because I want to play um, games on Thursday right. and Friday. Hey, Elspeth, how are you doing? Thanks for joining. No squeeze. That's it. <laughs> Evolution. <laughs> With Lucky Date, my friends that I haven't seen in weeks. I haven't seen anyone in such a long time. I'm starting to go crazy by myself at home. I thought her persona would have um, evolved. You see Snappy Turts and Beckon Stance hugged them for me. I'll give them air hugs. <laughs> Wow, they only gave me 4,000 money. Cheapskates. Cough in their mouth. <laughs> it's good to hang out in small groups. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And thankfully, most of the places I've gone out to, everyone has been really good about wearing their masks, like, staying separated. I mean, there's the occasional old people who, like, only cover their mouth and not their noses, but I'm like, they're old, they're sitting far away from me, I'm not gonna go anywhere near them. Whatever. Is it? What? La foi. Foi? Ha! <laughs> it changed to Sumide Yoshizawa. Now rank up, rank up. No, no, this. That should have been an automatic rank up. Uh, where is this? I'm at work right now. I see sunlight in your room. Didn't know you had a window. Yep, right there. It's weird to be streaming in the daytime. Also, hey Regal, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Hope you're having fun at work. So the shadows were behaving unusually because of that ambush. Well, we may have been run through the ringer, but we have a mission here. Let's check out that door. Ah, yes, you're right. Completely forgotten. Third time. I got a car, but the dealership wasn't OC and no one had masks. Holy crap! What the heck? Oh yeah, that is true. Okay, so I went to a drive-in movie theater in Glendale, and everyone was wearing masks outside, except a Tesla dealership. No one was wearing masks. Everyone was getting into the same cars, and no one had masks. They were all touching the steering wheel, touching the doors. No masks. It was crazy. Hydrate. No signals available, so I can't even watch stream. I'll come back in a couple hours. Ah, sorry about that. Oh, of course. Mm-hmm. Figures it won't open normally. Try checking out authentication device on the side there. Awesome, blah, blah, blah. Took a look around, but it looks like it was built so it couldn't be accessed anywhere else. You'll need an ID for the door. That lock means there's gotta be something important in there, though. Let's go get an ID. But first, we need some sort of clue. Oh, look! Yes, their ambush attempt failed. Now they're examining the authentication device. They're not getting anywhere without this ID, though. This is the end of the line for them. Well, now I just have to chase you down. What's up, Oracle? I just said there's a communication between the shadows. Our ID hunts finally come to an end. That shadow over there has one. Looks like your snooping- I mean, your tech skills came in handy again. I didn't even spot that shadow. I don't think he knows I heard him. Why don't you ambush him for the ID? You can't reach him from here, though. You'll have to go around the back and through the auditorium. Understood. We'll need to take the hall up ahead. Let's go. Make me dab. <laughs> I didn't know these were things. <laughs> hey, Jay, how you doing? Thanks for joining! How are you? Hope all is well. I am doing well. Can't complain. I hope you're doing well too, dude. Uh, where am I going? Uh, auditorium. Was it this way? I don't remember where the auditorium is. Who is best girl? Wrong answers only? Uh, uh, wrong answers. <laughs> I mean, in my heart, Makoto's best girl. Best girl for life. Boo, you're not even real. Uh, so we have to go around the back. Ew, creepy. They're all frozen. Um, is there a voosh voosh? Oh, yep, there's a voosh voosh. There's a voosh voosh. But where do I voosh voosh from? 
Also, hey, Bambo, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Uh, Makoto then. Makoto, the best girl. Uh... How do I latch on? Oh, okay, if I go up here... No? Hello? Do I have to- Oh, wait, there's stairs on this side. Ha ha. Ha ha. I knew that. Also gotta start looking for will seeds, and I can't even get that way. Lovely. Uh... Oh no! My stock is full! I should get rid of stuff. I have an alarm! Yes! I looked up who to sacrifice for Akachi and Kasumi's final stuff, um, so I gotta do that. Uh, I gotta get rid of some dudes. Because I need... Who to get rid of, though? Gabriel has my ice. I think I could get rid of you. Yeah, because um, Ishtar has Panta Ray, so... Delete you. Uh, honestly, I think I could get rid of you. Yeah, you have Sai. I don't need you. Okay, that leaves up three spaces. Just want to finish exploring this area before I move on. Hi! Makab! Uh, oh, who do I have equipped right now? Oops. Persona. I should have Yoshitsune on. Uh, Chi is best girl for me. Chi is waifu. Chi is a cute girl. Kasumi or Sumide if you want best girl. Reaper farming. So I'm a new run. Nice! This is still only my first playthrough. <laughs> Nebidos. Cool. That's what's awesome new! I didn't fuse him before? Wow. Hi. Uh, Chimera. Cool. Now I think I'm all full up, so I will delete people again. Yeah, you're totally new. There we go. You're strong. Excuse me, I attacked you first. Rude. Oh, oh. you know it. Currently getting my Arsene 99 max stats. Wow. Decisive rapier. Yes, go ahead. She can't cook, but still love Chia. Okay, that's another thing I didn't like about Persona 4. How they kept saying, like, oh my gosh, girls can't the girls can't cook. It's terrible. I'm like It's it's not that funny. Like, I know if you're not an expert at cooking, or like, used to cooking, you're gonna have like, disgusting food, but it's not gonna turn out like a total train wreck. Like, it's really hard to burn stuff. Yeah. It's, uh... I don't like the, oh, people don't know how to cook tropes. That's annoying. Jump down. Break it. Look at that persona. Look at all them personas. Hi. Die for me. There's a shadow. Should we go for it? Yeah. It's really hard to make a dish taste like nothing. It really is. I mean, if it doesn't taste like anything, add salt. Like, not that hard. You might be able to intercept some useful information. You should head back to your post. You're supposed to be in the observation room. Stick with the plan. Don't go acting on your own. I'm only trying to eliminate any potential risk for our master. But I guess I shouldn't keep my idea on me out here. Fine, I'll return to my post. What? Mama? Sorry, Joker. The shadow does head out. Ambush him. Quick, go, go, go! Kill them both. In the end, I come back down here again. The Phantom Thieves. I must have followed. Damn it, I told you. Now we have to eliminate them for our master. Yukiko's a master at this. Dionysus! Ah! Pow pow! If you feed a gold persona has a hangman strength during red alarm, your persona gains 10 stats instead of EXP. Ooh! I love when you're at the school camp weekend and Chia has to cook curry and it came out spicy and everyone passed out. I c we got the ID. Now we just have to... 
It sure feels like we're one step closer to the treasure. Might as well try the idea on that door now. I mean, the very first time I cooked curry, I made it too watery. That was the only bad way I made the curry. But to have it turn out like a monstrosity, it's really hard. Think Lisa can cook, but you know how she adds spice? Oh, can't handle spice. It opened. You did it, Oracle Senpai. Oracle Senpai. <laughs> I like the sound of that. From here on out, we're off the map. Keep your guard up, everyone. Is there a save point nearby? Because I want to go fuse a final weapon. Might as well take advantage of the alarm while I have it. We're in the corridor? Okay. Velvet room. Doko. Doko. Velvet room. Avenza! Avenza! I shall guide you to me. Why would she call her senpai if she's the only one who's in school? Um, because she's a... She's a phantom thief, the senpai. His normal voice! The prison door is open. The state of the Velvet Room reflects the state of your own heart. The room's changes reflect your showing spirit of rebellion to the entity that binds your future. Indeed, your change in appearance must also be due to the rebellious spirit you've harbored for so long. And with that spirit, you appear to have grasped a new possibility as well. Possibility? The current you should be capable of fusing new personas. Please make good use of this to keep the ruin at bay. We will continue to bribe aid on your perilous journey. Now, to your business. Also, yeah, Futaba is younger than Sumide, right? I still can't walk inside the velvet room. Even though the door's open. Uh, I just want to make sure that the new dudes are here. Chimera. Because I did delete them. Chimera? Okay, cool. Who are the other ones? Nebidos and... Nebidos. Okay. They are here. Uh, create. Itemize. Who did I... Whoops. Okay, so for Akichi, I need Futsunushi, and for Kasumi, I need Sandolphin, and I have neither of those. So... I will delete someone. So this is here. Whoopsies. Uh, Persona... Delete. You, I will do Kasumi first, so Sand Dolphin. Moon, 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 moon. I'll worry about fusing everyone later. Moon. Sand Dolphin. Create, itemize, Sword of Sinai. Go ahead. And with that, it's done. Just got a screen protector for my phone because I use it for pretty much everything, even second monitor when streaming, so I want to protect it from scratches. I don't understand people who don't have any screen protectors or, like, phone covers. It's very brave of them. Uh, equip Sumine with that. Yes. Okay, so next time it will be Akech. I save. I kind of don't want to rewrite these because I want to go back later and, um. No, 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 no. And do the bad ending routes just to unlock the movies. So, yeah. Now we go corridor. And now we wait for another alarm. Might as well have it. Is this some kind of storage area? Oh, we go through hassles of getting this ID and this is where we wind up? Don't be too disheartened just yet. Considering the size of this room, there are most likely multiple exits. If we can make our way through here, I believe we'll be much closer to the palace's central area. 
So basically, we just gotta keep charging on. Well then, let's hurry and get the hell out of here. Being psyched is fine and all, but we don't have the best visibility here. Stay on guard, alright? Nonsense. Guns blazing. I also gotta keep an eye out for, uh, will seeds. Woo! Hi! If you have an iPhone or anything like that, it's best to protect the screen from the scratches. I, I put screen protector on everything. Um, my Switch screen, my Cintiq, my, uh, PS Vita, PSP. Anything that has a screen, I put a protector on it. I do not want to risk scratches or cracks. Ew, ew! It's a hand! Okay, I think I have to keep eagle vision on everywhere. Because I don't know where I'm going. Die. Or don't. Ooh, you're funky. Quick against light, okay. Mara uh, but if kill them all. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, I was worried that the um that the weird one was gonna explode. So a TV too. Oh, no! I don't have a screen protector on a TV. <laughs> Anything small and portable that has a screen, I put a screen protector on. Um, let's see, this is a very big place. <laughs> Fafnir gets experience. So cute, no Fafnir. Yucky. Oh, I should make sure I have uh, more space. Interesting. Oh my gosh, that's a Fafnir. Mm. Okay. Uh, I should delete old people. Yeah, there we go. Because if it's a new one, they'll just keep staying in my party. Hey Light, how you doing? Thanks for joining! You're early as heck today, yeah. I have plans at night, so I wanted to get a daytime stream in. I hope I'm not missing the will seed, but Morgana hasn't piped up yet, so I think I'm fine. Maybe those. Nope, I hear a ding a ding ding. I hear a ding a ling a ling. Where is it? Where is it? There. But where do I like? There we go. No, nope, that's a talking about. Fafnir is rough to fight. Good thing I'm not fighting it. <laughs> I'm just blazing through. Okay. Uh, go out this door. Go. Oh <gasps> no, Loa! Loa! Uh. You guys can just... You know what? I said I would keep you, but bye. Get away. Um... Shoot, did I missed an area? This place is confusing as heck. Hey, look. Looks like it goes over there. Is that the exit? Let's wrap this up, Joker. But there's stuff to see. Yes, a lower floor. Nebiros, no. Give me Loa. He is under... He hits super hard. <sighs> Glad I don't have to fight him! Where does this take me? To this place. Loa? Nebiros, nope. Um... No, didn't want to jump down. Oh, or did I? Because there's a strong dude. 
Or is that the same strong dude I fought earlier? Fafnir. Wait, but there's a door here? Takarabako. Personally, I'm so OP it's easy, but either way, you can abuse tech damage. <laughs> uh... The only reason why I'm going around so, like, um so much is because I want to make sure I'm not missing the will seed. Mm. I think I'm back at the beginning area though. Yes, I am. No, I'm not? Is this new? Get that. I feel like Batman. I feel like an Arkham. Well, I guess I'll know if I'm missing- OH MY WORD! That was behind me. Where do you- Did I go up that one? Oh yeah, whoops. I didn't mean to jump off. Please, please let me back up. Let me back up! Oh no, I fail- I messed up. Uh... Let me back up. Shoot! Now I'm lost! I shouldn't have done that! I'm a fool. Wow, this place is freaking confusing. Uh, no. Why did I have to try and explore everything? I'm so dumb. Now I have to do this all over again. Ugh. Get up there. And uh, get up there. Nope, nope, don't hide. Get up. I'm terrible at directions and I'm terrible at reading maps. Don't do this to me again. Okay. Next time, don't fall off. Wait, I think I came up the wrong way again. No, that's it. This is the exit. Oof. Nothing here. Okay. <sighs> Hey, this dungeon sucks! Okay, monitoring room. And we still don't know the name of this palace? That's interesting. Safe room! And heck yeah, we're gonna save. We move on. Whoa! Hold on, look over there. Security is even tighter here, apparently. They appear quite formidable. That means this place must be important. Let's take them out whenever we're ready. I'm ready now. Let's go. I forget the legit name of palaces. Me too! What is every everything's real name? We'll surely be walking into a fight. Have you finished your preparations? Yes. Very well, let's go. So you dare defy his excellency. Out of the way. For you to give me orders. In three runs, I've never got all of Madaki's gold seeds. Really? <gasps> Scatpack and Kuchu Lane! Oh, two of my favorites. Oh, I love you guys. Could I, I always get them. <laughs> Who's weak? Oh no, I didn't play- I didn't do darts with him to like up his damage. I mean billiards or whatever it was. Okay. Oh no, she repels it or blocks it. Whoopsies. I was too hasty with my button pressing. Yeah, I should just fry them. He's resistant to physicals. What was Scathack weak against? I don't remember. I don't think she has any weakness.
Baton pass to you. Oh wait, you don't recover SP either. Damn it, you don't even recover HP. What? She has eye counter. Why is Akichi's defense so freaking weak? Oh no! Again, I was too hasty. She blocks Aga, right? Okay. I couldn't get the second one, I think, so I just never got it. Ah. Uh... Oops, I should have healed Akichi. And I'm inflicted with freeze. That's it? That's all the. Uh, so, Champion's Cup kind of sucks. Doesn't really heal that much HP. Oh, I'm so lucky. So lucky it's a crit. I have you, right? Yeah, and also you're a mini boss, so I can't talk to you. They only give me 25,000 money? Pshhh! Brave step. Increases the chance for critical for all allies for three turns. Uh, I don't really care. Bye-bye. I believe that takes care of that. So, where are we now? This room seems very different to the rest of the palace. It was more heavily guarded as well. Could this be some sort of surveillance room? The monitors are displaying various rooms within the palace. Wait, we were being watched this whole time? I don't know about that. Yep, I knew it. This room's more of a mini mainframe than a monitoring system. All sorts of information is being collected here from across the palace and getting converted into raw data. Data collection? But what for? You know, this room ain't got any sort of way forward. Think we gotta find another path somewhere else? Actually, it looks like there's a path beyond these cables. We're not- we're, we're sure not using it as is, though. Oh, what is it now? Is that Mementos? I've tracked the location all the data is being sent to. Looks like it's going into Mementos. You might be able to make some headway if we investigate this location. That reminds me, Lavenza did tell us. Dr. Maruki is utilizing Mementos to destroy all of reality. Even still, are those really data cables? Uh, let's go check Mementos. Agreed, sticking around here isn't gonna help us any. Alright, let's get out of here for now. Let's see if a Mementos trip does us any good. Hopefully they'll let me do Mementos requests. Champions Cup did heal and attack up. Oh, okay. I was stopping by super quick. Maybe when I come back, you'll still be streaming. If not, have a good stream. And this palace is tedious at points. All right, thanks, Light, for dropping by. Have a good day. And yeah, this palace is very tedious. A lot of small areas, lots of jumping around. Hmm. And you had made the right choice with Sumina. I got an eye for talent. Hmm. Good work today, but you got school tomorrow. Don't stay up too late and then. Cat! Cat! Let me hang out with people. You must be tired today. No, I'm not. Mm. I'm not tired. Don't force me to sleep. Mm. I'd like to thank everyone for letting me join the team. I'm glad to be here. I'll do my best to pull my weight. We're happy to have you. Yeah, welcome. But you can loosen up a little, okay? Don't worry about being so formal. I'm sorry. I'll try to adjust that in the future. Still sounds pretty dang stiff to me. A thousand pardons! And now she sounds like some kind of samurai. Hey, either way, we got another teammate now. That's awesome. Indeed. We're glad to have you as well, Yoshizawa-san. Well, as long as we're dropping the formalities, you don't have to bother with the honorifics. If it's okay, I'd like everyone just to call me Sumine. You're sure? In that case, once again, welcome to the team, Sumine. Thank you. Oh, about tomorrow. Are we all going into that momentous place? I think that was the name? That's an option. But we still have plenty of time. We don't need to attempt an infiltration if we're not wholly prepared. Yeah, that's our leader's call. We'll be counting on you more than ever, Jelly. Got your bags. I'm ready anytime. I'm gonna try to do friendship stuff. Mm. 
You've got more firepower now, but our target this time is so much more powerful than any we faced so far. We should probably get ourselves as ready as possible, as Yusuke said. This part now you can do mementos anytime along with quests. Then let me try to get the temperance target. Ohio. Yo, what up, Mishima? About the fan site requests. If I find any this year, I'll be sure to pass the info on to you. That's good. There aren't as many posts now, but it looks like there are still plenty of people in trouble. We're all canting on you, Phantom Thieves. Dispense justice! There are still people in trouble out there, huh? That could mean there are still some targets left in mementos. Whether or not, whether there are or not, we'd better be prepared for anything. Who knows what might happen? Get the temperance, dude. I was gonna say you have to be close to fishing. Hey, Tab, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Yeah, it finally hit the royal content. I'm happy. Hey, if it's okay with you, then... Can I see you after school? I'll be in the usual spot. <gasps> An wants to talk with me. Alright, thanks. Uh, I can go on ahead. Oh, sorry. We're all good now. I'm gonna get going. See you later. Oh, so... Wait, Toskun, please come to the student guidance office. Why? <gasps> oh, at social link? Kawakami social link? Sorry to pull you out of class, but it's about Takas- YES! YES! About Takasuku's guardians. I told them that I'm not going to pay them any more money. I'm quitting my part-time job too, although I'm still in talks with my boss about it. I'm going to devote myself to being a great teacher. No matter what others say, I won't waver. So thank you for giving me such good advice. I just thought you should be the first to know. Miss Kawakami, you have guests. The Takases are here. They're here? At school? Perfect time to go into mementos. How long are you gonna make us wait? Him again. You know it, lady. How rude. I guess a student is only good as a teacher. Obviously, you lack a proper education. You thought you could just call and say you're not gonna pay anymore? Who do you think you are? It's what I decided for Takasakun's uh, Takasa sake. I'm going to make sure there won't be any more students like him who. So you're just trying to get out of your responsibility? I bet you don't even care about Taiki. How are you still a teacher? Maybe we really should sue the Board of Education. Are you okay with that? A teacher who caused a student to die would surely cause a scandal. I'm not going to run or hide. I'm going to spend my time taking care of my students. If you want to take legal action, then go ahead. Regardless, I'll continue teaching. I've decided that's the best apology I can make to Takasakun. Paying money to YouTube is not the solution to say the least. Mm. Along with saving you, maybe I should tell everyone about your little secret. You know, about your little stint at a sex worker. How did you? Oh, so I'm right, am I? What? I mean, the amount of money you're paying us can't just come from a teacher's salary. Well, shall we head over onto the faculty office? Stop, please. Ha! A teacher with you in the sex industry, you're definitely done it this time. How unfortunate for you that you thought you could just leave Taiki's matter unsettled. You know what you have to do now, right? Pay up and don't ever call us again with this garbage about stopping the payments. <sighs> I guess I can't quit my part-time job just yet. You can't give up! I know, but what am I supposed to do? What about the Phantom Thieves? Would they even help someone like me? No, oh, that's impossible. <laughs> I've got to do something. I can't do this anymore. What are the names? Who? The Takasas? The husband is Toshio-san, and his wife is Hiromi-san. <sighs> I can never forget them. I send them money every week. Wait, why? You don't intend on doing something, do you? Please don't. A Shujin teacher asking the Phantom Thieves for help would be... Oh. I'm sorry. I was so excited to tell you what I had decided, and then it ended up like this. Just forget everything, okay? If you think about it, I'm right back where I started. <sighs> I guess I'll never be able to change. Yeah. <laughs> Class is about to start. I need to go. Mm. We're gonna do the targets. I've never seen this link so late. That's kind of tight. It's cause I don't really care about Kawakami, so I didn't prioritize her. <laughs> Whoopsies. That was on Hey, Talk To Me for Persona Fusion. Nice. Does the school's atmosphere seem different to anyone else? Atmosphere being the general mood, I suppose. Everyone seems so happy. Some of them even seem like entirely new people, even. I've been seeing it too. You think if this is Dr. Maruki's influence? If their stories and circumstances seem radically different from before, it's a safe bet. 
This is all so crazy. Jelly, let us know if you want to head go to Mementos. I can be at the hideout anytime. Hideout? What's up? Where are you all gathering? At LeBlanc. Is that best? It's a public cafe. It's cool. No customers around anyway. We're always there anyways. And it's settled. We'll all meet up at LeBlanc. Okay, I'll see you all there. Make sure we're all stocked up with our support supplies. We don't want to run out of something when we need it most. I think I'm pretty well stocked up. We have until February 3rd. Uh, but wait, An wants to talk to us. Didn't seem like Lady An had something she wanted to say. I think she's at the underground mall right now. Why don't you go check up on her? I shall. <gasps> Sorry, what? Hello, Senpai. Are you free today? If you do, oh. Uh, is An's persona thingy only today? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. But Sumire wants to hang out. But Fusion. Be available always? Okay, so then I should hang out with uh, Sumire today. Cause I gotta make sure to like um match her. <gasps> Wait, I don't have a I don't have a faith persona. Woo 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 woo. Yeah, I don't have a faith. Whoops. Uh, velvet room, velvet room. Hi, hi. Hi. That was dangerous. <laughs> Um, I don't really need a strong faith, so I'll just take out Phoenix. This is just for the sake of social link maxing. Oops. Eh. Okay, send me the time. Everyone in the world seems so happy, but it isn't right. Um, should we go to the palace today? Nope, let's hang out. Hang out? Don't overthink it. I got this. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Senpai, um, I want to talk to you about something. Do you have time? Yes. Hang out with her. Thank you. Um, can we go somewhere else? It's a bit difficult to talk about it here. All party level 3 personas are always available. Nice. Um, Jelly Senpai. I'm so, so sorry. Seeing me trying to act like Kasumi must have been painful and awkward for everyone. Everyone must have noticed that I was acting strangely. They were probably being nice to me, knowing that I just lost my sister. But even then, I had no idea I was even supposed to be sad. I didn't remember that my sister was gone. When my coach told me to think about who I really am, I just thought it was just figurative, something about my slump. I was just living my life, like I didn't even care that she was gone. I can't take the shame. Uh, it wasn't on purpose. What could you have done? At least, at least you realize it now. Yes, I have to reflect on everything I've done wrong. Ever since we were kids, Kasumi was always the one who decided what I did, what I chose, where I went. I couldn't do anything without her. I suppose it's clear why my grades weren't going up much. I was never on Kasumi's level to begin with. I was so pretentious, so wrapped up in my own stupid little problems. I was too self-absorbed to do anything. Um... Not your fault you were being pulled along at your sister's pace. Don't beat yourself up. I'm sorry, I lost my composure. I'm starting to remember things from our past now. It's hard, but I'm trying. There's a lot. It covers everything, starting from when Kasumi and I first got into gymnastics up until just recently. I want to talk about how it used to be for Kasumi and me. Will you listen? I'm not picking any of the answers she likes. Uh-oh. Kasumi started gymnastics really early, and I was even younger, so I copied her in almost everything. I went to her to class, too. I was too little to really understand the sport or the rules. But everyone praised me when I did well. The coach would get me little rewards like ice cream cones. We did our best trying to learn the moves and routines since it kept getting us ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> Good memories. Hi. Huh, I suppose you're right. We ate ice cream together. We talked. We laughed. Those days were so fun. And one day, around the time we started going to junior meets, Kasumi asked me, if we can be number one in the world, does that mean we get all the ice cream we could eat? All with a straight face, of course. She could be really funny sometimes. So obviously I told her, Kasumi, you're super genius. That is genius. I want all the ice cream in the world. She really was a genius, though. Everything came so easily to her, and every day she'd only got better. You remember what the coach said, Senpai? That my 
Well, that Kasumi's greatest weapon was her boldness. Kasumi was always so bold. She was like a beacon of confidence. And one day, I realized I'd never catch up. It didn't matter how hard I tried. I have consolation prizes for the rest of my life. Kasumi was always the one up on the podium. But even when she won her ice cream, she never ate it without me. I always told her not to worry about me, but she still said she'd wait until we could enjoy it together. She really believed in me. She said we'd be the best in the world someday. She had her own practices to do, but she was always so busy helping me. She spent hours trying to help me. She cared about you. She was so kind and strong. She was the perfect older sister. Oh, it went offline for a bit? Oh no, I didn't get any notifications. Kasumi's kindness was so... so... infuriating. I can imagine. If someone so perfect is always next to you, it's kinda draining. She was always the one on the podium, surrounded by flashing cameras, but all I could do was watch from the shadows. I'm not Kasumi, and no matter what I do, I'll never be like her. If she'd given up... if she'd just given up on me, it wouldn't have hurt so much. At least then people would stop trying to compare us. It must have been hard. No, really. Yes, that's one way to put it. The thought just kept coming back. Every day, my mind went back to it. Everyone would just be better off if I didn't exist. Either that, or I should just be Kasumi. She's the one people really want. Sumide is the one who's useless, pointless. Who would care if she died? Your sister would care. But my sister died instead. Why did she have to protect an idiot like me? I... I watched her... Uh, I can't tell you to try not to think about it, because it happened in your life. You have to accept it. Yes, I'm done running away. Jelly Senpai, I can't stop here. Now, I want to keep doing gymnastics as Sumi did. I want to hit those heights Kasumi was aiming for. Otherwise, I'd never be able to face her. Please, will you keep going out with me now that I'm Sumida? I want you to hold me to this, to make sure I don't run away from who I am again. Uh, duh. I will. Really? Thank you so much. You must think I'm pretty lame. But I guess that's Sumida. That's who I am. I have to be stronger, both in my heart and with my gymnastic skills. But for now, I'm Sumida Yoshizawa, and it's nice to meet you again. I'm definitely gonna have to Chihaya. Fitness talk. Ooh. Cool. I feel so much better with all that off my chest, Senpai. I think this really helped me. Now I can focus on turning over a new leaf and doing my best. Let's get some practice in until I have to go to club. We'll be training hard, even harder than before, Senpai. I'll be extra strict from now on. Go visit Fortune Tie. Yep. And I gotta make sure to do memento soon. It's just that Sumida wanted to hang out with me today. Um, hello. I'd like to thank you for what happened earlier today. And I'm sorry you had to see such a pathetic aesthetic class, I don't be. As soon as I acknowledged myself as Sumida, my gymnastics training started to fall apart too. But this is the real me, I guess. Do you want to run away? You have to face it. So what if it is? Not a big deal. Huh? I... well... <laughs> you know? You're right. So what if this is who I am? I made up my mind to keep moving forward, even without Kasumi. I can't just run and hide now. I'll think about where Kasumi got her strength from, and what I can do as Sumida. I'll calm down and think all of this through. Thank you for listening to all that. Okay, I'll talk to you again soon. Ba -doo -ba -doo. I feel like I'm gonna need to visit Fortune twice to rank up with Kasumi. Yo ho, the weather's getting colder. Make sure to keep warm when you sleep. There's been the streak of weird posts on the fan site. My mom is acting weird. I'm so lonely and hungry. Can she not see me? She doesn't answer me. The house is so cluttered. It's such a mess now. Worth looking into. I thought you'd say that, so I grabbed some extra info in advance. It says the smartphone's registered owner is Kuniko Kagami. Uh, the kid's gotta be making the post using her mom's phone. I already checked the name with the MetaNav, and there's a hit. I think it's safe to assume that this mom is neglecting her kid. Eh, nah, I didn't do much, except for, you know, everything. I think a kid should never have to feel like she doesn't matter to her mom. I want to bring her back to her senses. Let's discuss this more at the hideout, okay? Yay, I have so many mementos targets! Oh, and Oya wants to hang out. Uh, Kawakami Iwai. And do I have a devil? 
I do, Nebidos. Cool. Take off my mask. Sony, strange, shake my mama. Everyone looks too happy. Woo! Get a fortune reading. I would like to do an affinity reading with. Where is she? Oh, Sumida. Yeah, fortune red. Ikimasyo. Ikimasyo. Yes, okay, we are gonna deepen. Woo, that's good. Um, if I trigger alarm now, would it work? You know what? Let's just trigger alarm anyway. Just for the next time I go in. Uh, 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 future alarm. Mm. Wait, so is the fusion alarm on now? It is! Okay, so I'll make uh, Akechi's final thing. Akechi was... I can make both his gun and melee. And I have to make sure to do the armor too. For run there, there, yes. Okay, so then I could just do it every day. So I need to get Futsunushi. Futsunushi, Futsunushi. Okay, create, itemize. That is done. I am done for today. And if I go into mementos tomorrow, I hope it's still in effect. Whoops, why am I saving? I didn't give uh, Akachi the... Oh, I forgot to change everyone else's um accessory. To not be the... whatchamacallit? The... The experience one. Uh, let's see... It would be nice if you had something that... Evades win. Money boost. Hide. Beware of rumors. Uh, null, bless, curse. That would be awesome. Life boost. All stats plus three. All that attack boost. Gun accuracy. Fortify spirit. Samurai spirit. Increases evasion from criticals and magic attacks. Inflicted with ailments. HP is... Ooh, wow. That's awesome. Increase his max HP by 40%. Uh, gun skills. Life bonus. Automatic Master Kukaja. No. You know what? Since I'm gonna be fighting the Reaper eventually, I'm gonna do the uh, Null Bless Curse on everyone. Not you. Null Bless Curse. Where are you? Ah, Doko. Whoop, they pass it. Okay, it's the Saint Hermelin badge. Uh, increases max. No, I'll do Nurse Null Bless Curse because. You guys are weak against that. Okay, cool. Now I'll hang out with Oya. President inside is a castable con- What? <laughs> President inside is a castable consecrate? What does that mean? <laughs> okay, but Oya. My head is splitting. Worse than tough. I need a break. Yep, we got good stories. Let's go. Hang out with her. Lao Chan, two drinks, please. Here, take a seat. <sighs> so exhausted. Thanks to my quota and that chief. But I made some progress on my personal investigation. 
I did some research on the Phantom Thieves. I'm starting to get the impression they might actually be the real deal. No signs of an internal power struggle, no dirty money changing hands. It almost seems like all this recent negative press was fabricated. There's no actual proof to support the claims. And I mean, you're still a fan, right? Honestly, the more I get to know about the Phantom Thieves, the better I understand them. I can relate to their sincerity. They remind me of how I used to be. I already know firsthand that fighting the evils of society is a never-ending thankless job, but I still do it nonetheless. I bet the Phantom Thieves share that type, same type of passion. I never thought I'd hear you talking about passion, ichiko chan Maybe I'll just talk about the Phantom Thieves have influenced you. Or maybe it's just a kid. Maybe. I mean, he is a pretty big fan of theirs, so... Yes, this is Oya. That's right. What? You found Kayo? Where is she? What do you mean? You can't tell me. Why the hell not? Hey, what's going on? Wait! Kayo. Could it be? That was one of my journalist friends. He thinks he found Kayo. He followed up on a pretty far-fetched string of rumors from me, but now he's saying he doesn't want to get involved. Damn it, why the hell won't he tell me what's going on? I can't just give up now. At least that's progress. I mean, we didn't even know Kayo-chan was still alive before now, so... Stop right there. Huh? I knew it. You've been looking into Kayo's case behind my back. Well, not anymore. I've cut off all your resources. I suggest you drop this investigation if you don't want to face the consequences. Wait, you're the one who pressured my contact to keep quiet? I told you, this is where your wild goose chase ends. Oh, and I'll be doubling your quota again. No more of this personal investigation. Got it? What? Are you trying to kill me? Hey now, Chief. Can you really do that? I don't think anyone asked for your opinion, biatch. <gasps> Listen to me, Oya. Give it up, unless you want to end up like that stupid friend of yours. Don't talk about Kayo like that. Don't you dare. If you even think about talking sure, on Kayo again, I won't hesitate to beat the living crap out of you. Well, hold on. Take back everything you just said, or I'm gonna do even worse. It's too late now. The higher ups have decided to put that incident to rest, and that's what we're doing. You understand? That spineless little bastard only cares about himself! <sighs> this just had to happen as it got a new lead on Kayo. What should I do? Should I go knock him out? Uh. Think of another way. It's easy for you to say. No, I need to stay calm. Calm, yes. Calm. Can't give him any more reason to fire me. Just stay calm and. Oh, this sucks! An even greater quota is gonna be a problem, but I can't give up now. I promise I won't stop fighting. I'll prove it to you with another great article. Exclusive The Phantom Thieves, Stealing Hearts and Changing Lives. Ugh, sorry, I really will try and calm down now. Ba -doop -ba -doop. Double damage for a magic attack accessory? Uh uh. Oya doesn't have a mementos target, right? Because if she does, maybe I should try to get hers before I go into mementos. All that BS he said is really getting to me. I wish I was better at controlling my emotions like you are. Um. I don't think she's charming. You should work on that. <laughs> you little brat. More importantly, Ichiko chan, how are you going to manage having your quota doubled? I'll just work twice as hard. I should be fine as long as I keep getting good info from my favorite source here. Oh, that reminds me. Let me hear all about today's scoop. Think she does? Okay. Then I should get her to one more rank up before I go into mementos. This is all for final weapons. Do it for the final weapons! Sup, kid? Thanks for bringing in all that good info. You're really the only reason I'm still surviving through my crazy quota. And honestly, help me, you were there with me earlier. If you weren't there, I would have just gone full blast on Chief, and that would have been it. But I finally got a lead on Kayo. I'll do whatever it takes to find her. That's spirit. Right, I'm not gonna let this crap get me down. I made of tough stuff. Watch me, Chief. You're gonna be crying at my feet. Still, I do have my limits. I gotta do something about this insane quota. Well, I'll come up with something. You just focus on getting me new info, okay? Okay, see you soon. Night. Man, it's the 14th. Do I have enough time to do everything? Credit right. as always. Today's headlines are Japan first in the list of most prosperous countries. Others are praising it as the perfect model of a developed country. The first economic boom of the 21st century. Several businesses are reporting massive increases in earnings. The new cabinet shows strong approval ratings. Has our antiquated political system been changed for the better? Everyone's faces look so calm for some reason. This happiness can't. 
It's not real! Did he? Huh, <laughs> what's up? Well, you know... So, Jelly, you got time later? There's something I wanted to talk to you about. If you're free, I mean. Sweet, thanks. It's definitely worth waiting around. Crap, everyone else already to school? We gotta book it, Jelly. I was cleaning my room the other day and I found a collection of stories that I bought when I was a student. You've all heard of The Restaurant of Many Orders by Kenji Miyazawa, right? It was aimed at children, but even when you read it now, it really pulls you in. Speaking of, one of Kenji Miyazawa's strengths in his sense of naming is his strength sense of naming fictional lands and his stories. Ihatov? Ihatov? Is the most famous among them. This place is loosely named after the author's hometown. Okay now, Toskun. Where do you think the fictional land of Ihatov is my model after? Iwate? Nice. Yep, that's correct. Yep. Iyatov is Kenji Miyazawa's fantasy world, his utopia. A utopia is an ideal world, separate from our own world. Your own little paradise, huh? It'd be amazing if that actually existed. All the booze and meat you want. Oh, but then I'd be fat and perpetually hungover. You know what? Maybe things aren't so bad as they are. Kawakami's pretty realistic. About the actual Asian, does something happen? One of my fellow artists no longer works in the medium. You mean they gave up on painting? To be precise, their entire history and existence as a painter are no more. For real? The actualization sure is some spooky stuff. But it doesn't mean Maruki just killed their dream. No, in this reality, they have apparently always been an archery. They're quite skilled as well, from what I've gathered. Seriously? But why archery? I don't know the exact reasoning, but it was most likely Maruki's judgment call. He pried into your associate's cognition and concluded archery to be the best fit for them. So that's what Dr. Maruki considers salvation. He probably concluded that the arts were just generating suffering for them. I suppose he thought this would be a superior path. Now that you mention it, they did say before they were stuck in a terrible slump. But doesn't that mean all the effort up, to, um, ah, up until now is just wasted? Protecting people from their pain must matter more than their lost efforts. From his point of view, of course. What a hellhole. I couldn't have put it better myself. It's so pretentious, it's nauseating. Throwing away our past to live in a blissful ignorance. Yeah, I could never live like that either. I hope they don't have any more, like, cell phone conversations. Oh, look, someone else I know, and their utopia, and blah 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 blah. I wonder what Ryuji wants to talk about. Um, sorry, kid. Yuji's more important. Uh, wait, Yuji should be here, right? Yuji's usually chilling at school. Yep. Yo, got some time? There's something I need to tell you. Otherwise, I mean, it's just gonna keep weighing me down. Yes, hang out with him. Sorry if I'm taking you away from anything. Let's go, dude. Let's save every day to maximize your days out to get everything down. Oh yeah, true. Uh, wow, look at that poster. <laughs> How do I say this? Uh, I'm flattered, Yuriji, but... <laughs> it ain't like that. No. I mean, I guess it's weird inviting you to my room out of the blue just like that, but don't get the wrong idea. Well, there's something I want to talk about. Since we're bros and all, I figured I'd just invite you over. Look, I, I'm sorry. I know I gotta apologize to you. About what? Look, I'm getting to it. Give me a sec. Laugh it up, but I get pretty nervous about talking through this. It's like, you know how things have been for me from New Year till a little while ago? How Dr. Maruki gave me a dream life and I just kind of went with it? We basically spent last year together, and you supported me through a bunch of personal stuff too. I even told you I'd help whenever you needed it, and now, well, even I know I really let you down. But you did help me! Nah, that was a little late. You already figured everything out. You from the start, right? I mean, sure I could fight with the rest of the team like nothing's wrong, but I don't know. It feels like that'd be betraying all the stuff we built up together. Either way, I couldn't just let this go. I gotta sell the thing somehow. So watch this. <laughs> Not gonna stop till you say I can. Can't forgive myself unless I do this. Can't believe how late I was. 
crappy thing to do. <laughs> you can stop. This is a little weird. You can stop. This is awkward, man. Wait, already? Come on, I'm being serious here. I can't think and flex at the same time. Should have figured this be pointless. I tried to think of something good, but even I know I'm dumb. So I... I really wanted to keep going with the track team. Hoped I could keep it going. Uh, maybe get a scholarship and be a star athlete in college. Make life easier for my mom. And yeah, the Doc's big dream would have made it happen. But still... I don't know. When I think about it, I realize maybe it isn't that hard a decision. I went through all that bad stuff, got wrapped up in hating Kabushida, turned into some delinquent, almost got both of us expelled, started hanging out with Ana and Mishima more, I even had my big conversation with Nakaoka and Takeishi, even if they beat the crap out of me. But that's all part of my life. I still own that, you know? It was a real crap show sometimes, but I came out of everything stronger. I'm here because I beat my problems. I can't just pretend they never happened. Wouldn't be right. Mm, I know what you mean. You've really matured. That's why you woke up. That's why you woke up. Yeah, and that's why. I'll stick with the reality I fought for. The one where we went through all of our stuff together. That's where I belong. Do, do. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Fusion! Ha! What do you look like now? Ooh. What the hell, man? <laughs> Didn't know I still had this much power in me. Not bad. William! <laughs> whoa, 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 I mentioned early stream, but I didn't know it's this early. <laughs> hey, Nanacha, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Man, I feel way better now that I finally spilled my guts. Maybe tonight I'll finally get some sleep. Uh, That's all you needed? Look, you have no idea. When I gotta take a bath knowing I'm not gonna get to sleep in the futon after, that kills me. Uh, sorry. I guess I just dragged you over here to listen to me whine. Look, I know sometimes I'm a real pain in the arse, but from now on, I'm gonna run with everything I got. So all you gotta do is count on me, Jelly. Bye-bye. Eccentric Temper, Fighting Spirits. Next physical attack deals over double the damage for all allies. Um... Mm. Ah, I like what I have. So... Bye. Uh. Welcome back. We got a really scary request. It says kill me. Whoa. Sounds like he's in a pretty bad spot. The details are pretty ugly too. The guy's name is Nao Minamoto. He lost both his parents really young, and he's had to take care of his little sister ever since. He's been working really hard at a part-time job to support them both, but right now he hates his sister so much that he can't take it. She's his only family, but he can't control how he feels. At some point, he was so mad he shoved her, but she stumbled and... I guess she got hurt really badly. It was an unfortunate accident, but he says he can't accept that. Is his sister okay? It seems like she's fine. He just thinks there's no guarantee it won't go worse next time. He'd rather just be killed. But changing his heart is bound to help somehow, right? You need to kill off those negative feelings inside of him. Kill me, huh? Talk about a morbid request. Let's help him before he does something even more drastic. It's AoE charge? Yeah, but eh. Ah. Oh. Then maybe I should have gotten rid of charge. No, but it's a lot of SP. <gasps> Crossword! Hey, little. Lined up at school festivals. B O O T H S. Nope. Stalls. If it's not booths, it's stalls. L L S. Genius. These simple shops are often created for school events by the students. All sorts of food and other products can be found in stalls. Stall staff must meet certain conditions to be permitted to set up shops, such as sending reports to the health office and maintaining proper safety standards. Because the guy decided to play Judgment, even though it's a part of the Yakuza series spin-off, I never bothered with it much, but I just need to play something, anything Yakuza or lose my mind. <laughs> That's cool. 
I can't do Kawakami, uh, Hifumi, Max. Man, I wish I could meet my party members at night. Can I do darts at night? Um, let me save. Kakuka. I'm gonna try going to Kichijoji. Uh, darts and billiards. And I'm gonna do darts and billiards with um, Kasumi and Akichi, hopefully. I mean, just darts. Let's play darts! Let's call someone. Uh, Sumire. Please call Akichi. Use. Please call Akichi. Or it's Juji and Haru. Okay, fine. Jelly Senpai, can we play a match together? I think I'll throw straighter if I'm teamed with you. As for the rules, shall we try 301? I think I should be able to handle that. You can do it. I'm cheering for you. Fight to this. Since it's 301, I don't really have to aim for triple 20s. So let's just go for a bullseye. Round two, so it's my turn. I'll need to watch my form when I throw. Okay, so I gotta get 50 50. Go easy on her. No, we're on the same team. And it's good if I get more points in the beginning so that she can finish it off. So that her um, baton pass rank will be max in just one game playing. Okay. 65, I'll do another 50, and then I'll do, uh, I'll do an 11. And then all she has to do is reach for 4. Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. Shut them out. <laughs> this is my last round. I have to make accounts. Yarimasu. I can finish it, but what would be the best way to throw here? Uh, throw like a gymnast, don't think, just feel, trust your instincts. What answer would she like the best? Trust your instincts. You're right, I just have to believe in myself. Please just hit the four. Just hit the four. Yes, good job. So, so proud. Nice pair play. Senpai, we got zero points! Does that mean we make an excellent team? Is it because we were perfectly synced? I feel so motivated right now. Yes! Baton pass, Max! It's my turn next. Let's both do our best. Uh, how are things with Haru? She's at rank 3, so I don't really have to play with her. I'm sorry. If Akachi was here, though, I totally would play. You played really well that game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me let me go home now. I'm done with stat maxing. Why are my glasses hurting me? They didn't hurt the first day I wore them. Ugh. So. so, just something's been on my mind for a while now, actually. Can we talk sometime? Whatever's good for you. Thanks. See you later. Before I do anything, I'm gonna double check that Oya doesn't have um Persona Five Royal Devil Confidant. Gonna make sure she does not have um 
a mementos target. Otherwise, I'm just gonna go into mementos today. Uh, oh, she does have a target. Okay, so I'm not going into mementos today. Um, Futaba is glowing. Haru is glowing. Donde esta Yusuke? Oh, he's not available today. Okay, so I'll just hang out with Futaba. Let me save. And Sumida doesn't want to hang out today, right? No, she does not. Wait, and I'm gonna double check the map to make sure she's not anywhere. Haru? Kichijoji. Okay, yeah, she's not available. Anywhere. Whoa! That's the palace. Okay. Hi! Oh, Jelly. You got some time right now? There's some time I- There's something I want to talk to you about. It's really important. Hang out with her. Thanks, then come to my room. Actually, hold on. Can you come a bit later, Jelly? I'll leave my door open, so just come in. Futaba's so OP. Nice. Hmm. She should be good now. Jelly? You can come in. Oh my, why? Why are you wearing this again? Sorry for calling you over. What's with the mask? Um, there's something I've been wanting to talk to you about, so... What's it about? It's about you and me. I made a promise to help you whenever you're in trouble. For your sake and for mine. But now I... You're helping now. Yeah, I'm gonna help us fight back. I'm a part of the Phantom Thieves, right? I feel the same way as everyone else. I mean, yeah, I don't want to accept this real- Is everyone just gonna be like, Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry I didn't help you out before. I feel terrible about it now. I know this isn't real. I figured out that a while ago. But I thought, if I got to see my mom again, then it was okay. I'm so selfish. I was thinking about what I wanted. You're mad, I know. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm not mad. Don't lie to me. You're mad at me. You have to be. Why wouldn't you be? I betrayed you. Don't you get that? You didn't. Sorry, I guess I'm a little freaked out. This isn't even what I wanted to talk about. There's something else I wanted you to hear anyway. Can I, um... Is it cool if I say it? So, like, Dr. Mardukey's reality isn't totally 100% illusion, right? As far as I understand it. Well, maybe I'll never know for sure, but... If it is true, then I really did get to see my mom again. She was so nice. I'm glad you got to see her. Me too. But I guess I won't get to stay with her. I know. I mean, I know now that this is all in my head. But I wanted to talk with her more. Go on shopping trips and stuff. I don't know, just... I wish I had more time with her. Mm. But still, like... We can't just live totally dependent on Dr. Maruki's reality, right? Even if I won't get to see my mom anymore. If I could manage to keep working hard and moving forward, like I was doing in our reality, then I... I think she'd be proud of me. You're doing great. Yeah, um, thanks. So that's what I'm gonna do. If Mom could see that I was working hard, being a part of the group, I think she'd be really happy for me. Let's do this. Yeah, I'll be counting on you. This time, I'll do what I can to protect you, and everyone else too. So let's take back our own reality. The reality where we can be anything the world throws at us, as long as we have each other. The reality my mom gave me. <sighs> like, I love the kids. I love seeing the persona transformations. But if all of them are gonna be, oh man, it was so happy to think about this, but I know that's not the real thing. And I know we fought hard together to build blah, 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 blah. I'm so sorry I ditched you. I'll be a better person. I don't wanna keep reading out like five more conversations <laughs> like that. What's this power? I didn't know I still had it all in me. Yes. Ugh. Repetitiveness. <laughs> Thanks for listening to all that. I feel a lot better now. Master Futaba has reached full recovery. Get ready for a perfect navigation no matter what we're up against. A bold claim, Master Futaba. What can I say? I'm my mom's daughter. I'll be pestering you a lot from now on, so sorry in advance and thanks. 
If only they were just like automatically voiced. That would be awesome. Infinite scheme. All that attacks may defeat all foes and fully restore HP to all allies. Wow. Ultimate support. Ultimate support effects of strengthening and healing all allies may activate in battle. Wow. Yeah, she really is OP. Damn. Does Akichi have a persona transformation? Does Kasumi? I mean, Subida? Thieves then updated. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, is Oya not available? Come on, I need you to go into mementos. Frack. Frack and crack, then you know what I'm gonna do? More darts and billiards. This time with Akichi. Mm, let's play darts. Uh, let's call someone. Cause he's the only one at two. Loser. Yeah, I'm gonna use my own dart set. Kasumi and Akichi are automatic. Thank the lord. Let's begin our team game. Let's get started. Ready on my blah 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 blah. I hate Akichi because he wants to play freaking 701. Oh, whoops, I should have been going for triple 20s. Oh, well, too late. He only needs to go up one more rank anyway, so I'll just keep doing bullseyes. Give me high five. Ha! <laughs> He did! Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, bullseye, bullseye, bullseye. Do, 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 ba, do. Hat trick. <laughs> My turn. <laughs> it's so cute that these kids keep high fiving each other between every round. Like, yeah, we're best friends. Except not because you tried to kill me. Magikayo. Magikayo. Yes. Do, 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 do. Bo, 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 bo. I'll pull this off without a hitch. Oh, sorry, gotta take my headphones off. My ears hurt too much. Ow. Ugh. Okay, so now I get, get 101. Boy. <laughs> take my time. Final round. Yes! 51. Can I get triple 17? No, I don't think I can. Let's play it safe. And then just get the one. Get the one. Come on. Eww. Got it. That's virtuoso. Akichi is custom. Man, eh? Me after rank 10. She'll text John the second to chat if he found a treasure for the palace. Oh, okay. <sighs> Uh, I'm not gonna play with Morgana. Screw you. Okay, skip all that. I mean, I'll definitely find the. Oh, I definitely gotta get her to rank ten though. Oh gosh. I need to meet with her like four more times. Yeah, cause she's rank six. <gasps> you scared? Cold as always, isn't it? That's part of Winter's Charm, I suppose. The air is so pure and crisp. There's a strange clarity to it all. As if everything's suddenly brought into sharper focus both within and beyond ourselves. You okay? <laughs> I wonder, I'm... There's no pressure, but can I see you again later? Just whenever you have time. Thanks, I'll see you later. <sighs> I love being in the art world! Blah 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 blah! If that's wrong, Maranella was a bad man. Blah, 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 blah. Really, Sumida, you don't want to hang out with me? 
Is uh, what's his face available today? Uh, Shinya. Shinya is available. <sighs> Wait. I did his mom's. No, I didn't. And I didn't get his mom's name. Did I? Anyways, let's yeah, save just in case. What's Shinya's rank anyway? Confidant? Tower, 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 tower. Oh, he's only seven. You know what? I won't. I won't bother with Shinya, cause yeah, Tower doesn't really need a. I don't need Tower to fuse any of the final weapons or armors. I'll just focus on um, Temperance and Devil. At least they're at nighttime. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Sorry, Shinya, I'm gonna hang out with Yusuke. Oops, wrong one. Uh, Yusuke, walk away. Sure. What brings you here? I came to see you for some time right now. There's, a, there's something I must tell you. Go with him. Please come with me. Haha, <laughs> that's his painting of on. I know my call was rather sudden, I can only apologize. We've already decided we're going to oppose Dr. Maruki, so I know it's far too late to say anything, but... What's wrong? Yeah. I just can't keep averting my eyes from the truth. I betrayed you and always stand for it. How can I pretend I'm still worthy of our lofty ideals, of your support? I'm an utterly hopeless fool. Nah, you're just kinda weird. Please, I don't deserve consoling. You gave me my strength. You taught me to face the truth without fear. That strength, that anger is how I rose up against Mararame. I saw him for the fraud he was, and I freed myself from his lies. Just look what I've become. Dr. Maruki gave me a false security. He showed me a life spun from my deepest desires, and a fool that I am, I welcomed it. What indescribable humiliation. How could I be such a detestable, narrow-minded sheep of a man? Calm down. I love your coat. I cannot. This is no time for calm. And you, you of all people deserve to shame me, but you still say nothing? I betrayed you. I've spat on the very principles of art, and more than that, I've spat on all you did to help me find my answers. I'm nothing. Not even worthy of the empty words I spoke. I can't even bring myself to look you in the eye. Forgive me, Jelly. Such is the human heart. Are our hearts truly so deluded? Are we foolish enough to cling to these misguided fantasies? You offer me mercy I do not deserve. There's no beauty in this. I was a slave to my hubris all along. How did I ever believe the meaning of the true beauty was in my grasp? I was just a fool, lost in dreams. So you're giving up? Giving up? So Jelly, I... I can only apologize. You've saved me from repeating my mistakes once more. Compared to the grand legacy of my mother's art, I am still but a chick toddling in her shadow as she soars. I dreamed of flying at her side, yet for all my leaps of faith, I only plummeted from my nest again and again. What I needed was a teacher. To grasp the beauty of my mother's work, I needed a guiding hand to offer criticism and validation that I earned for it. But why was I so convinced that my teacher would be someone in the art world? After all, I have a friend like you, and our talks together have already led me to so many beautiful revelations. You're gripping kind of hard. <laughs> My apologies, I got ahead of myself. But my point stands, I believe there's still a great deal I can learn from you. And if that's true, then I found my teacher, teacher, and with him the path to truly grasping my mother's art. I will not lose my way again. Let us walk that path together. Ugh. I believe you got his target already. Also, check to see if Kasumi Subida is up each day. Don't always contact. Yep, yep. That's why I always check to see if I have, um, if she's gonna be up. But she wasn't available today. And if she is available, she's only in Kichijoji, right? I didn't see her. Oh, damn? He's a freaking pimp? <laughs> see, so this power is both my core and my essence. Go to Kichi. <laughs> Jelly, this reality of ideals and perfections is not wholly wrong. Truly, there are parts of it I find almost painfully beautiful. However, you have helped me see clearly again. I believe I wish to return to our own reality. It suits me far better to paint with both ugliness and beauty upon my palette. That's the use no? Ha, indeed. <laughs> Let us return to our true home, to the reality where I discovered true beauty. Now kiss me. Ah, uh, but first, you know what they say about fighting on an empty stomach. 
That reminds me, I haven't even offered you any tea yet. And you brought some kind of treat with you too, didn't you? Is it sweet bean jelly? Or maybe a baked dessert like dorayaki? Or maybe perhaps you bought... <laughs> Let's go eat at a diner, dude. Unparalleled eyes. Hyakaryoran. Increase attack, defense, accuracy, evasion for all allies. Yo! This is like freaking heat riser for all out. Oh, Masuku Kaja. Bye. And it's only 24 SP? No, wait, no. Masuku Kaja was 24. Kaka blah blah is 90. Oh, man, now I regret uh, messing up Ryuji's stats. It could have been charged for everyone. Kaio, finally! I'm having trouble with Kaio's case. I'm not sure how to handle it. Now I can go into Mementos. Because this is where I get her uh, target. It's no use. All my connections who knew where Kaio was are gone, thanks to the chief and my publisher. Well, I'll say something. Uh, <laughs> so I have a pet cat. Uh, you seem tired. You can tell? Well, I guess it's pretty obvious. Pulling these consecutive all-nighters is really wearing me down. At this rate, you're going to work yourself to death. You've been beating your quota, right? Of course. They'll fire me if I show any signs of weakness. The chief really wants me to mess up, and I'm not going to give him the satisfaction. <laughs> He's some kind of tyrant. Tell me about it. It's a race to see whether I can find Kaio before he crushes me. That's not good. Shouldn't you do something about the chief before you keep chasing Kaio-chan's case? There's nothing I can do- wait, there's nothing I can do about a guy like that. He's rotten to the core. And despite how he acts, the higher-ups like him. I have no one to go to. It's over. Yeah, he didn't seem like the kind of guy to change his mind. But at this rate, you won't be able to continue your investigation. What do you think, kid? Do something about the chief. Ugh, I'm gonna die. What's the chief's name? Why? You gonna try to find his weakness? His name is Shinpei Honzo. I've heard he's a good husband, and he used to uh, cover economic foreign policy. I hope it's just me overthinking things, but he's seen your face, you know. Don't go trying anything heroic. She's saying this for your own good. Got it, kid? I wonder where oh. Kaio is. Sorry, but I don't feel like getting any info from you today. Thanks for coming all the way out here, though. I'll see you around. Free Oya from her demands. Okay, so it's the 16th. I have... I think I have enough time to um, meet all my friends. <gasps> but Makoto wants to see me today. Ooh, I want to speak with you. What's up? I just want to talk, that's all. If you have the time, is that okay? Thank you, and let's keep moving for now. I'm sorry guys, I'm... Should I skip this? Dude, something is wrong with Ushimaru. What do you mean? I don't know, something's up. I guess it's not wrong, but he's all different. Anyone know what he's saying? Ushimaru who? Uh, strict teacher. He's a chalk drawing marksman. Ah, say no more. What exactly is different? His personality? What, he's super nice now? That's just it. He's so nice, it's creepy. And no matter who I ask, they tell me he's always been like this. We basically got people saying he's basically the school's own Buddha. It does sound as if he's been enlightened, I suppose. So Dr. Maruki has changed someone's personality? If he really wanted to change, then yes, it's possible. What? Ushimaru of all people? It's like how I wish to be cussing me. It's like your own st situation, I suppose, probably. Something in his past must have been overwritten. It's also possible his personality just changed, independent of any external events. You figured a real Ushimaru went through something bad? Maybe he was so nice to everyone, students took advantage of him and unfolded the language. Ah, that would be traumatic. Well, we can speculate all we like, he's the only one who could say for sure what's changed. It's still difficult to understand, so if it would serve their happiness, I've even one's personality can change. Like a change of heart. Guess, though it's not like Ushimaru was full on evil. I'm getting so mad, I'm gonna go to sleep. Is that even a thing people do when they're mad? Honestly, you could always just pay attention to class. Oh my gosh, these text phone conversations. Yeah. I, I don't care. I'm gonna skip them. They're they're always the same. Oh my gosh, this person changed? Oh my gosh, this is weird. Hello. Uh Takin. Makoto Ryuji. No sumire. Okay. Uh library. 
We gonna talk to Makoto. We gonna talk to. Oh, where is she? Oh, there she is. You're here. I've got a little bit of your time. There's something I need to tell you. Hang out with her. Thank you. Let's get going. So all I need to do is talk with a uh, Haru, and then I'm done with my friends. Sorry for calling you over so suddenly. There's something I just had to tell you. No wait, I still have to talk to On. Whoops. What is it? Ooh, I'm sitting on her bed. Honestly, I wanted to apologize. I couldn't back you up when you needed me the most. What do you mean? How do I know? Yep, yep, yep. Totally forgot about On. <laughs> Talking about Daru Maruki. Ever since the new year, I've been stuck in his fake reality. You remember that time before I joined the Phantom Feast when I called you to student council room? I challenged you on your ideals, threatened to expose you all, as if I knew anything about what was going on. But since then, I've learned so much from the Phantom Thieves, from you. You've saved me more times than I can possibly count. After all that, I promised myself that if you were ever in trouble, I would leap in to save you. But I forgot that vow. I just threw it away so I could cling to father and sis. It's awful to know that all along I was so weak and self-centered. We're all like that. Do you think so? Maybe you're right. It's strange, though. I can always forgive mistakes from others, but never from myself. You know, I was thinking I'm more lonely than I was willing to admit. Father never spent much time at home. When he was here, when he was there, he always had his mind on some case. And sis put all her time into her work, for both our sakes. I respect them both so much, and I still do, of course, but I can't just let them take care of me forever. That's your decision? That's what I think, at least. Though it's a fairly new idea for me. If I hadn't been in this situation, I'm not sure it would have even occurred to me. In any case, I've made up my decision. I'm done just sitting quietly and doing as I'm told. If I'm weak or self-centered or lonely or too dependent on my family, then that's my problem to fix. But my pain's still a part of me. All the struggles, your support, it's what's helped me stand up for myself. I can't lose that. I'm not exactly abandoning the person I was, but I figure trying to bottle it up will only make my life harder. I want to be able to look at the most awful, disgraceful parts of myself and still be able to say, so what? That's great. It's a relief to know you're supporting me. If I can get everyone to understand me and really see who I am, then I think that'll give me strength. If I'm ever tempted to like this again, I'll remember to stay true to myself, even if it's not a conscious decision. That's why I wanted to apologize, because I'm not completely ready to stand on my own just yet, but I'll keep trying, and I won't run away. Oh man, I bet if she was my girlfriend, we would have spent more extra time together. Hang out deep into the night. But sadly, she's not my girlfriend. Yeah. Whoa, it's a freaking Batmobile. What the heck? So this is me? Mean? Oh, I get it now. You're Agnes. Mm -hmm. It's strange. All it took to make my heart stronger was to put myself first. Uh, sounds like you. Sorry, but it looks like I'll still have to rely on you a while longer, so I hope you'll be prepared. Thanks for staying over so late, too. I'll see you later. Now, what trait do you get? Gaia blessing and checkmate. Decreases all its mass, Dakunda. Gaia blessing increases allies' chance of inflicting burn free shock by 50%. Dakunda's only 10 SP, checkmate is 90 SP. Uh, no wait, this removes all stat debuffs, but this actually gives them debilitate. <sighs> Shoot. I thought it was a train. <laughs> Shoot, what should I get rid of? Energy shower? No, that's pretty useful. I'll get rid of Maraku Kaja. I'm playing on easy mode anyway, whatever. These then updated. Woo! Um, can't hang out with uh, Oya tonight. Mm, okay, so now I'll go to darts and billiards, and I'll play billiards to raise our technical damage. Welcome. Play billiards. Billiards. Who you wanna call? Ghostbusters! Hey everyone, hang out with me. Yes. <laughs> Let's get started. 
the intensity okay. right before the game starts. I love it. The ways the balls are positioned. I'll need to make a difficult shot to clear this. That pose. Are you going for that shot? Ooh, made it. Now that's what I call a massive shot. I don't know. That was too good. I'm stunned. On Sunday, you can get Arms Master or Spell Master on last Sunday to reduce SP cost. Nice! You actually pulled off that shot. That's why you're our leader. Looks like your challenge brought everyone together. Now raise our technicals. Yes! We'll knock down enemy. Awesome. That was fun. My arms are killing me now. Glad to see everyone had fun. I gotta say, though. Thanks for playing billiards. I think you've learned more about blah 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 blah. All my stats are max, though. Yay, friendship up. That'll help for Kasumi. Ah, good morning. Hey, Jellykun, might I borrow you for a bit? I think we need to talk. Can you come to the roof after school? Something happened. You'll find out soon enough. Only joking. It's nothing terribly important, really. Whenever you're free, I'll be waiting. I know it's a bit sudden. My apologies. Oh, well, looks like the train's coming. Let's line up. When will Sumida be available? Oh my gosh. It is already January 18th. I need to go into Mementos and I need to go into the palace again. That's two more days. I, oh, I only have 11 days to see her. I feel her. The economy is apparently doing pretty well this year. Because of that, I have tried getting into the stock market. Not a thing you want to jump into with no experience. I lost five months of my allowance in one fell swoop. It wasn't a huge loss, so it's not that bad, but it's quite a thing to stare at your failure in the face. My portfolio looked awful. Hey, speaking of things being awful, I used that word because my portfolio looked absolutely terrible, but awful originally meant something else. So Tosku, a question. What did the word awful originally mean? Impressive because it's full of awe, no? Yeah. That is correct. Yes, it was only comparatively recently that awful took on a negative implication. It once stood for awe of any kind. That's why older English documents use phrases like awful majesty and awful power. It could still be used to imply a certain kind of dread that was just one of several possible uses back then. But times changed and language evolved as centuries went by. We ended up using with more specific words, awful for the bad and awesome for the good. Uh, kind of mad scramble to get everything done. Yep, I hate this. I hate the stress. <sighs> I just wish everything was automatic. Like I didn't have to spend time with my friends to rank up their persona. But <laughs> it's time already. Let me say one last thing. After this winter, you'll all be studying for exams. So you can use your time wisely. Course like off. Either way, I guess your test scores are going to be awful. One thing's for sure, you're definitely an impressive guy. All inspiring might be a little too much, but I know I can count on you. Yo, Sumida. Sumida? Yes. Sorry, Haru and on, but Sumida calls. Save first. Everyone, blah 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 blah. Let's hang out. Don't overthink it. I'm trying to do everything I can do right now. I'm thinking of taking special lessons from my coach at my club. It's a special program that centers around boxer sizing. It's really stress and it's open to the public. I was thinking you could come along if you wanted. Yes. Smang out with her! Really? Thank you so much! I'll introduce you to Coach Higu Hiraguchi-san once my lesson ends. She's an amazing person. She's been guiding Kasumi and me since we were little. Now let's head over. <gasps> so cute! Kasumi helped me through the special regimen several times. It gets tough after a while. Your limbs start feeling heavier the longer you keep them up. Whenever you did this before, all I could focus on was how well Kasumi was doing and how much I wanted to stop. Kasumi was probably so disappointed in me. I got tired out so quick. Mm. Who knows? 
She never said it, but I was disappointed in myself at least. She never doubted herself for a second. And then there's me. Oh, I think it's almost time for my coach to show up. I'm kinda nervous. Yeah, she's strict. You can say that. She's tough on us, but she's a great mentor. She's been helping Kasumi and me for a long time. Even though all my stupid delusions as Kasumi, she never stopped helping me. I don't know what I'd do without her. <gasps> her coach is cute! Hello, Coach Hiraguchi. Sumida. Maybe it's just my imagination, but you seem like your old self again. Yes, I'm sorry I worried you. Um, I've... I've been running away from what happened to my sister. So you realized. Are you okay now? I'm not totally back to my normal self, but I'm working towards a new goal. I want to be the best in the world, so now I'm going to do what I can as Sumire. I see. By the way, who's this? Oh, this is my senpai from school. We both came here for a lesson. Oh, so you were... Fine. Let's have you go first, Sumire. You can start with your combination. Yes, ma'am. Uh, hi! She's got some amazing moves. That was so freaking fast. She's got those aggressive moves down. She really is just like her sister. Hmm. Okay, you can take a break. We'll do some more later. <sighs> Thank you very much. Um, Coach Hiroguchi, thanks for all your help today. So, how did I do? I tried to put some real force into that combination. You said you were going to perform at Sumide this time. I didn't see that at all. All I saw out there was Kasumi, or a shadow of her at least. What? Kasumi defined her performance by her boldness, yes. But that's not something you can appropriate for yourself. It came from the energy within her. That's what made her Kasumi. I told you to think about who you really are. Seems like you still don't understand what I meant. Hmm. You need to stop hiding behind Kasumi. If you keep denying yourself like this, how can she still call you her rival? Huh? What's that supposed to- I never wanted to try draw attention to it, but Kasumi had a very competitive streak. She hated to lose. She would always tell me. She was so jealous of her little sister and her delicate, graceful style. I can't lose to her, she said. She wanted you to see that. She said that? That's impossible. Kasumi could do anything and I- I was nothing. I've said all I wanted to say, but I suggest you think a little harder about it. Hmm. Okay, it's your turn now. Get ready! Um, you okay? Thank you, but I'm fine. I noticed she was quite impressed with your physical abilities. Compared to you, though, that was pitiful. Me? Graceful? Now that I think about it, I guess that's the one thing my coach used to compliment me on. But even with that, I couldn't match Kasumi's performance at all. And now she says Kasumi saw me as a rival? I don't believe it. I mean, all I was doing was imitating her. Ever since, even since the beginning, I was just following Kasumi. I was fine in the beginning. I loved being with Kasumi, and it was fun. But ever since I started noticing the difference in her gymnastics skills, one thing became clear. I'll always be someone less than Kasumi. I'm just worthless, after all. Uh, you need more confidence. Believe in yourself. Well, Hi. yes, anyone can see that. Still, something occurred to me when Coach told me what Kasumi said. I realized, just like she wanted to show me what she could do, I still want you to see my own abilities. Remember? Like when I tried to show off at the back of the batting cages? Oh, maybe that's what I need to chase. Maybe that feeling can help me get some confidence. It sounds like even Kasumi liked my more subtle and delicate moves, so if I mix it with her aggressive style, it'll be like a duet. Right? Maybe I'll be able to step up my routine. If the key here is showing you what I can do, then I just need you to watch me again. Senpai, will you go out with me again? Uh, I could watch you forever. Oh, um, tell me, Senpai. You're not going to make me blush if you say things like that. Wait, you're going to make me blush if you say things like that. But thank you. I'll be relying on you. Be my girlfriend already. Please? Yes. Yes. I'll think about what else I can do. When I figure it out, I'll let you know. Oh, is it time already? Let's get going. Yes. What do we do? Oh. Okay, so maybe uh, tomorrow I should go into mementos. Oh, Senpai, thank you for coming with me today. Coach Hiroguchi is so strict, isn't she? She wasn't going easy on you at all. She used to make me and Kasumi work so hard. She was so harsh, even 
She even made me cry a couple times. But Kasumi said she was probably tough on us because she saw our potential. Thanks to Kasumi supporting me with her strength, I kept working hard. It didn't seem like you were struggling at all, though. You might just be as tough as Kasumi. Amazing. <laughs> I was internally screaming. Uh, it was a breeze. I love a good challenge. When it comes to working out, I don't mind a little challenge. It's good to like work out and like get your blood pumping and a little sweat going. Oh, I see. So you like to struggle fuel you. I wish I could do that. I can't stop thinking about what you mentioned, though. My own energy, huh? I guess I'm the only one who can find the answer. But I'll try with everything I have. For now, though, I'll talk to you later. I have nothing else to do at night since the ladies are held up. Um, so I could go to the gym. I could go fishing, but who likes fishing? No one. Mm. Yeah, I'll go to the gym. Uh, work out and get my physical stats up. Catch hmm. car in! I'm a master! Yes. HP increased by 7! I can read! But I have no more books to read. Whoops! May have just got her next rank up. Unlock on the call at the end. Nice! Ah, oh, good morning! Everyone's really changed. Can this really be what happiness is? Nah. Why don't we go to Mementos today? Uh, let me check and see if Sumire wants to hang out. Soka. If Sumire is not available to hang out, then we'll go to Mementos. If she's available... Oh, I still have to do Haru and Aunt's, uh, uh final fusion. But... <gasps> she is available! Maybe we can meet up today. Go at once. Well, I'm not going into Bellatos yet! <laughs> Let's hang out. Don't overthink it. Uh... Oh, it won't deepen just yet. Uh, decline. Sorry, uh... Chihaya first. Ooh, danger, danger, danger. Please let it rank up. Please let it rank up. With Chihaya's help. Uh, get a fortune reading. Please rank up, please rank up, please rank up. Sumide. That fortune read. I want 3 million yen in real life. Wait! No! I didn't see that we're gonna get deeper no 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 do we not shoot shoot frack frack let's hang out we're not gonna deepen yeah i don't want to hang out with her the more I see Sumire with her hair down, the more I see Futaba in her. Doesn't she? Or is it just me? Oh yeah, I guess, because they both have pretty long hair and glasses. I didn't notice that. Okay, well, Sumire doesn't wanna... I could go to the temple to, um... To be able to rank her up, but I might as well just spend today going to Mementos. Finishing up the tasks so that I can raise Temperance and Devil to max. So that I confuse final weapons. Okay, so. Oops. Um, I'll go back to Shinjuku. I'll put on the alarm. And we'll go into Mementos. Damn it! Why didn't we rank up Sumida? Sucks. Alarm. Uh, alarm. Half fortune red. <laughs> mm. 
Yay, fusion alarm. Okay, and now we go to the hideout. And we're gonna go into mementos after looking over all the requests. I'm still a newcomer, but I'll make sure not to slow the group down. I'm looking forward to working with you all. I keep telling you, you don't gotta be so formal. But if you want, I can teach you everything you gotta know about what we do as the Phantom Thieves. Sorry to interrupt, but I already explained everything to her. Huh? So she knows all about palaces and all that? Ah, uh, yes! Morgana-senpai already taught me all about them. Oh, yeah. Okay, then. Guess you missed your chance to become a senpai, duty. Shut up! Wasn't even aiming for that anyways. Oh, I'm so sorry! I didn't mean to ruin your chance to become a senpai. Well then, let's get back on topic. We should begin by investigating mementos, but I prefer to avoid dying in vain due to a lack of preparation. Therefore, it's more important than ever that you all be in your best shape before proceeding. As usual, we'll let Jelly handle how we proceed. Once we're all prepared, let's head into mementos. View requests. And I'm just going to zip zap zap through this. Oh my word. I wish there was like a skip function for it. Oops, the dialogue. So how many are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I still have to do winners don't use cheats. Holy crap. Okay, well, let's explore mementos. Let us consider our target total. We know of seven currently in mementos. Yes, let's go. Let's go. So, this is someone's pals too? Oh right, this is Violet's first trip into Mementos. Well, check this out. This place is everyone's palace. I'm not exactly sure what that means, but I do get the sense that it's important. Thanks for explaining. Good job catching up. <laughs> but doesn't it feel like the place has changed somehow? Or was it always like this? Think so? Looks the same as usual to me. You're kidding, right? This place has always looked rather bizarre, but the massive cables are a recent addition. Oh, yeah? They appear to be the same cables as those we found in Madaki's palace. It looks like our theory about them affecting this place was accurate. Yep, we nailed that one. Better than we thought we did, too. I'm getting strong readings all the way down. At least all the way to where we found the Holy Grail. But the God of Control isn't there anymore, right? Why don't we check it out ourselves? I've got something I want Violet to see, too. Me? We're gonna transform! How about that? Oh. Hi. Hmm. Talk about a low-key reaction. Well, it wasn't really out of my depth to imagine a cat turning into a car. But, but, my transformation! Wow, he actually let the cat part slide that time. Yes, it's that ability to imagine it so easily that allows Morgana to transform in the first place. Let's go already. Standing around here is a waste of time. But my main point is, I'm a totally different leak than those other cars. Hop in, you'll see what it's like riding in a high-performance vehicle. Blah. What's your phantom name? Uh, Sumine? It's Violet. Okay, now for uh, Akichi's gun, it's Vohumana. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, much uh, counselor, counselor, Fuhumana. Uh, create electric chair. All stats plus six. Damn. That is a strong. Oh no, it failed. I didn't save before I did it. Damn it. Damn it! What is it? <laughs> Let's 
Levanza shocked. Uh, angelic grace. I'll take it. <clears throat> well, I guess I'll fuse it next time. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna end stream here. I'm gonna take care of all of the um, requests offline. I'm going to make Akechi's final gun and Akechi and Kasumi's, I mean, Sumide's final armor offline. And then tomorrow we'll go into like the actual place we need to go into for um, story progression. Uh, yeah, and tomorrow I'll be streaming at normal time, so 7.45 uh, p.m. Pacific time. I just wanted to try to get an early stream done today. And we'll see if this Thursday and Friday I get to start playing Daigakuten Saiban. Uh, I still need to test out all of my equipment for setting up a 3DS stream. Let's hope it goes okay. So yeah, um... Whoever made it to today's early stream, thanks so much for being able to join me. Um, I know it was a weird time. It probably won't happen again, if anything. If I start earlier again, it'll just be like an hour earlier or two. Or not, we'll see. But my throat hurts, so I gotta go now. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all next time. Stay toasty. Have a good evening, or rest of the day, everyone. Bye-bye!